Hi everybody, this is Ramesh from Logos Classes. Today we will do question number 11 of exercise 1.2 class 6 maths knowing our numbers. This is the question. The distance between the school and the house of a student's house is 1 kilometer 875 meter. Every day she walks both the ways. Find the total distance covered by her in six days. So, I mentioned all my videos that after reading the question, if the distance or anything is in two different units, make into one unit, either in kilometer or in meters. The distance from the school and the house of the students is given one kilometer and 875 meter, not two meter full. So, she every day, she walks both the ways means she is going to school from home and from school coming back to home by walking. The question is, how many kilometers or meters she covered or the total distance covered by her, the student, in six days? How we can find out? What is the calculation here? So one day, how much she walks? Because she walks to and fro, going and coming back. It means, first solution, the first uh, sentence, distance between the school and the house of the student, that is one way, only one way, is one kilometer 875 meter. One kilometer plus 0 0.875 kilometer that is 1.875 kilometer how it comes uh, this way because here converting into kilometer is better than converting kilometer into meter because one kilometer is one kilometer is thousand meter or opposite way thousand meter is one kilometer so if you convert this one kilometer and 875 meter Total it will come 1875 meter. So it will be a big figure. Then we have to calculate both the ways distance. Then you have to take 6 days. It will be a very big figure. So better convert meter also into kilometer. So what we should do to convert meter into kilometer? Divide by 1000. Why? Because 1000 meter makes 1 kilometer. Therefore 875 meter is equal to 875 divided by 1000 kilometer that is 0 0.875 dividing by 1000 you can take you can put a decimal point from right to left three places 5 7 8 and put a decimal point here so identify that decimal point we are putting a zero also here 0 0.875 so the distance between the school and the house of a student one way is equal to 1.875 kilometer what is the distance both the ways she is coming back from school also by walking? That means 1.875 km she is going to school. Same 1.75 km she is coming back from school. Total is 1.875 km plus 1.875 km or 1.875 km multiplied by 2, 2 times. That means you can, here I am adding this 1.875 plus 1.875. 5 plus 5 is 0, carry forward 1, 7 plus 7 is 14, plus 1 is 15, we are writing 5 and carry forward 1, 8 and 8, 8 plus 8 is 16, plus 1 is 17, carry forward 1, 1 plus 1 plus 1, that is 3, 3.750, that is double of 1.875 kilometer is 3.750 kilometer in one day she is walking. Now, the question is, how much is uh, the distance covered by her in 6 days? What you have to do? Addition or multiplication? Both are correct. If you are adding it, for example, 6 days, 1 day, 2 and 4, 3.750, second day, 3.750, third day, 3.750, fourth day, 3.750, like that, 5, 5th day, 6th day. You have to write 3.70 6 times and add it. You will get the answer, but it is very lengthy procedure it will take more time that is why we are using multiplication multiplication is a repeated process of addition of the same number that i explained in my previous videos okay so instead of adding six because why here it is at least six digits six times 
is easy. But suppose if the question is for 30 days, you cannot write 3.750 in plus 30 times. So better 3.750 into 6 is the answer. You can do like this also. This is the easiest and better way. This is the method. So 3.750 km in one day into 6 days. So we can, let us multiply here. That is 6 into 0 is 0. And 6 5s are 30. Remainder carry forward 3. 6 7s are 42 plus 3 is 45. Carry forward 4. 6 3s are 18 plus 4 is 22. The answer is 22.500 km. That is 22 0.500 kilometer. It is the answer. You can write this answer split also 22 kilometer and 500 meters. 500 meter. This is the way also you can write it. Understood? This is the answer. So we will do the last sum in my next video. Thank you.